who's in the mood to multiply three-digit numbers by two-digit numbers. There are various strategies to go about this process, and I am excited to share some of these Movelas tricks with you. Here's the multiplication problem we will work with today, 365 times 13. I am going to start with the partition strategy. Partition means to divide into parts. I am going to divide the smaller factor into parts that are easier to multiply. The number 13 can also be written as 10 plus 3. I can now multiply 365 times 10 and 365 times 3. When multiplying by 10 I add a 0 to the end of the other factor. The product of this problem is 3650. Then I multiply 365 by 3. That problem is a little harder so I am going to add together 365 3 times. For a sum of 1095, I add the two products together for a total product of 4745. Wow! The next strategy is called the area model. I start by breaking down each digit in the factors to their individual value. 360 and 5 go across the top. 10 and 3 go from the top to bottom. I make a grid that is 3 columns and 2 rows. Let's get moving. I multiply 10 by each number in the top row. Here's what it looks like. 300 times 10 is 3000. I write the product in the first row, first column. Then I multiply 10 times 60. This equals 600. Then I multiply 10 times 5 which equals 50. I repeat the process with the number 3. This time the products will be written in the bottom row. 3 times 300 equals 900. 3 times 60 equals 180. And 3 times 5 equals 15. Now we are going to find the sum of all the products. I like to add down the columns. 3000 plus 900 equals 3900. 600 plus 180 equals 780. And 50 plus 15 equals 65. Then I add the numbers across for a final total of 4,745. The last strategy for today is called compensation. This strategy is helpful to use when one of the factors is close to a multiple of 10. In this example, we will use the problem 365 times 19. 19 is close to 20. So instead of multiplying 19 groups of 365, we are going to find the product of 20 groups of 365. 365 times 20 is 7,300. Now we need to take away one group of 365 to find the answer for 365 times 19. I subtract 365 from 7,300. I find a difference of 6,935. Well, it is time to get moving along. Good luck practicing.